drop a like in the next five seconds if you guys are hyped for Fortnite season 10 it's gonna be crazy welcome back to the soda channel I hope you guys are having a great day what I have for you guys in today's video is going to be the season 10 start date the end date all of the map changes all of the season 10 leaks and information we do have about everything that is going to be happening in the coming weeks of Fortnite. so be sure to subscribe with your post notifications on so you never miss out on a video like this and if you guys have your notifications on comment notification squad in the comment section down below it is greatly appreciated that you guys do have notifications on but every season in Fortnite, we do get a bunch of information and a bunch of leaks about what is going to be happening and the first place we can look to find some information and some speculation we do have on our own is in the battle pass as Fortnite does always give hints to the next season of what is going to be happening and certain location changes throughout the battle pass once you tear up you do get to unlock these emotes or even these loading screens which do give hints as we saw in one of them last season the volcano was erupted and we did get a few more hints about the season as well and so far in this season the one that everyone is talking about is the one with greasy grove supposedly like it is back but that could just be something to throw us off but we also have a bunch of news about the monster and the robot that is being built right now but getting in to the start date for Fortnite season 10 we currently have two possibilities with the extensions of the season before our best guess is that Fortnite the season 10 release will be on July 18th of 2019 seeing as each new season usually arrives on a Thursday, July 18th is the most likely season 10 start date, as it is exactly 10 weeks after the launch of season 9, but the possibility of it being extended could be in a couple weeks length of August 1st. And as I'm editing this video, I just got some brand new information from my buddy on Twitter, Friendly Machine. And for everyone wondering, the official start date for Fortnite Season 10 will be on August 1st and not when the current Season 9 Battle Pass timer ending states proof from an Epic employee on screen. What is said is, hello there, this is Mark, an Epic Gamer expert and fellow Fortnite gamer. It was extended for a few days because of the World Cup, so the actual ending of the season and start of Season 10 is August 1st. So there we go, the official Season Season 10 start date will be on August 1st, so get that down in your calendar to start playing Season 10 on August 1st. As well with what the Battle Pass will be looking like, the format will not have changed much. So first off, you'll need a total of 950 V-Bucks to purchase the Fortnite Season 10 Battle Pass. There will of course be new skins, emotes, stickers, harvesting tools, gliders, back blings, and much more. And Fortnite always tends to add in some new items that we do not see coming, so we could probably see another item come in as well. But getting into the map changes, this is where it is going to be very crazy with what they do, as every season they do add in a brand new area, as we saw the few seasons before, we saw the volcano come into the game. We saw Tilted Towers get a upgrade into Neo Tilted and with this robot being built over at the old volcano we have a whole bunch going on as well as the monster with what the big ice monster is gonna do so with the first one we are gonna see changed or just completely removed from the game is going to be Polar Peak as we know the castles on it are currently with the monster and it would just make a whole bunch of sense if that was out of the game as it's been in the area for a long time and no one really goes there anymore everyone wants Greasy Grove back so we could bring back Greasy Grove maybe extend Greasy Grove and there's a lot of area over there where Fortnite can add in a whole new area if they just completely remove the snow biome of the map it is summertime so it would make perfect sense for them to remove that and then the other area I could potentially see getting removed is pressure plant the volcano area sunny steps the airplane hangar where there are ballers at that whole area I could definitely see get removed because number one the volcano has officially gone away it's gone off now pressure plant is there where there's either going to be a newt go off or a robot we'll get into that in a little bit so like i've been saying those are going to be the two areas that do get changed the most and there could be some surprises as fortnite does do that a lot you do get an area where you can predict is going to be changed and then they surprise us with a map change so if there is any updates on that i will definitely make a follow-up video on the map topic so have your notifications on for that one now what is going on with the pressure plant area and everything over there with this robot that is being built is it a nuclear site what is going on over there so our friends over there in the PC community the leakers and everything like that confirmed 100% that there is a robot being built now there are eight pieces to this robot I will throw them on screen so we have their body we have the legs we have the head and everything like that so apparently what is happening is there's a robot that is being created to go ahead and fight the big sea creature that is basically what we know of the storyline right now and when we do start to get some more events 
event details, I will definitely be making videos on that and streaming that, as the event is basically going to shape what season 10 is leaded into being, and a lot of information after that event will lead us into what we know will happen in season 10. And this is like the first time we've had an event where it's going to be two things going at it. Usually we just have an event and it's one main thing where we had the Ice King throw ice all over the map. That was a one character, but now we have two characters going at it, so I guess we'll have to see what happens, and let me know down below what character you like the most. If you like the robot that is being built, or if you think the ice monster is pretty cool, let me know down below. But with all that being said, that is about it for all the news and information we have on Fortnite Season 10, so if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to drop a like on the video, subscribe if you guys are new to the YouTube channel, and remember to have those post notifications on, and I'll catch you guys in the next daily Fortnite Battle Royale video on the channel. Peace out.